Hey everybody, this is Petey from Skinnerack, and today I'm doing a video on another Hulk video, right? And um, this one will knock your socks off. This is the third fight between Namor and the Hulk. The first one is in Avengers 3. Then I think there's a Tales of Suspense one which is similar to this one and how it ended. But then we have this one where Herb Trimpey is on the title and it's an amazing one, right? So let's go through it, right? And we see Bruce Banner um, knocked out, but somehow survival floating. It's a gorgeous page by um, Stanley and, and Herb Trimpey. Right, so see the ship that's come up. It's actually Lady Dorma, right? And she's gonna give him a tablet to allow him to breathe underwater. Again, so he can receive medical attention he can only receive down at Atlantis, right? Right, so now Dorm has changed from being the evil person to the person who is the good Samaritan, right? I think around because early on she's the one who kind of puts, um, so I guess it's right because Samaritan likes you know, Sue Storm, so so Mistress Farrah, she's one that I haven't seen too much, right? But she thinks that she's going to break up Namor and Dorma by bringing up that she brought another man to Atlantis, right? And, and Namor is just, you know, ranting about the surface world and while he's talking, how much they've destroyed, and then someone comes in and he's not happy. And it's just power, and the next thing you know, it claims those of treachery. He says, What did you say? Secrecy and stealth. She has brought a surface man to our abode. He even plot, <laughs> plot together. Certainly, you'll never learn the truth, right? And this is, you know, Namor is prone to this sort of um, aggressive action, right? So he runs out. It's a, it's a, it's a take heat. So he goes out, knocks out her um, people at the doors. Is door must stand, stand you forth. <laughs> Where's the surface man? Then you know my worst fear that I realized. I'm betrayed by the Lady Dormo. Oh no, my prince, <laughs> I did not do so. Allow me to explain. Explain. How does one explain deception? <laughs> what has happened to me? These voices. So I remember the hope sleeping on sleep that I felt. And the next thing you know. And she's trying to tell me he's too ill. He said, I hear storming behind the wall. More like a raging dynamo. That's not possible. Anything, anything is possible. The Hulk. So this is some great stuff here. And some of Stan's best dialogue. He said, forgive me, lady, my lady. Now it's crystal clear. He held you hostage. <laughs> You're not, you're not free to speak. He said, he said, um, now grotesque won't prepare to feel the might of Namor. So puny fish man, what is your might compared to mine? And it's like a uh, great A stand dialogue. And he's like, and this one thing 
And that's the thing. Pope doesn't even think about it. He just already starts fighting. He doesn't. Namor he just said he was going to, but Hulk was ready to throw the first punch. And Hulk realized, hey, I didn't mean to harm the girl. I was only ready to harm the person, all my enemies. So he grants this thing to destroy him, and the Hulk, Hulk breaks it. Said, uh, no. <laughs> he said, uh, it's not my my strength alone that should prove your undoing. The Namer is a master of many skill, and the Hulk is a master of great power. <laughs> he said, um, power. How can a beast of one like you comprehend, comprehend the meaning of the word? Now sample the power of the Lord of, of Atlantis. Now creating a shattering whirlpool, right? And you see the Hulk struggling through it. Said, now the Hulk must be stronger, and it's going right. And then, and Hulk actually breaks through that, right? So now, while they're fighting, Lady Farrah's going to take out Dorma, right? Right before that, the Hulk he says, you want Dorma? Let me send, <laughs> send you there. And hits the wall. And thus, Richard Farrow was taken. And realized that she was right. Shouldn't have gotten into a fight in general. And then the Hulk was like, as I spring from this wall, be faster than the fish, fastest fishman. And then you see the Hulk going, and then, uh-oh, <laughs> here comes the Hulk, like a living torpedo, right? And he has to stop him, so the Submariner's going as fast as he can. Dormo wakes up, and then this explosion happens. Destroys the parts of Atlantis, ships, natives, they got to run, a tsunami is coming up, and the Submariner's sent going miles away, and then the Hulk was sent outside of the water. And minutes later, you know, the water restores the Samaritan's strength. So Samaritan goes up to finish the fight, and he said, there he is, plumbing like a missile. And then next you know, this, you know, he's going to try to reach him to finish it off. He goes, and then he says, he looks and sees it's not a, not the Hulk, but a man. And then he leaves. All right. So there it is. And I think this is in um, what's the name? In the origin of origins of Marvel Comics, which me and my brother read this, and we used to crack up. Like you know, I mean, it was like this was almost like reality when we watched read it as a kid, and then in our teens, like Stan's dialogue would just have us on the floor, like not fun of it. It was just like, it just had a funny quality to it. Uh, the confidence in the Hulk. And that's one of the things when he says um, Hulk is the strongest one he is, it's more like he's got, you know, he's just overly confident. You know, it's not just the strong he, he gets. He just like, no matter what, he's just going <laughs> to scream on everyone. But you can see in these last two um, Hulk things that I've done, Hulk kind of you know, it's like ready to fight no matter what. And it's very different from the stories we see where it's like, hey, Hulk is just wants to be alone. He's just so ready to fight. And that's what I think if you look at Burns Run, it was kind of getting him back to that. So, and he had, a, you know, his mind is wiped. He, um, he has a stimulator that he's overstimulated. So he's kind of back to this. So. There we go. We got another Hulk issue done. And I think with all these other ones, maybe I should do a Thor one. But anyway, spin rank out.